Okay, welcome back. It's the Pest Control Guys. We're here at Grain Valley High School today. We're where? Grain Valley High I'm School. I'm not going back to school. You can't nope, make me. Nope. <laughs> so stay tuned. Okay, so we're here with the band director. Travis Barzee is the director of bands for Grain Valley. We just got done with a tour. We love this place. It's love big. It. It's amazing. I, I'm blown away by this. So You guys are pretty lucky. We're very lucky. <laughs> <laughs> so selfishly, we just want to congratulate you on a good year. I know we ended um, with a couple of highlights. Do you want to cover some of those? Absolutely. So we uh, finished our marching band season this past October. Uh, we took the band to um, a variety of marching band uh, competitions here uh, regionally. Two local competitions and then um, a Bands of America regional up in Iowa. And, uh, and then we finished our season out at uh, Bands of America St. Louis, which is a super regional. Um, there were, I think, over 70 bands that competed at that uh, performance and they take um, you know, the top 14 bands into finals, and we were very lucky to, to be selected into the finals. So, so out of yeah. 70 bands, you were one of the ones selected in. That's right. Um, wow. Yeah, we were, the kids worked extremely hard. Um, it, uh, it's honestly unfair to have one person talk about the whole season just because <laughs> of the number of pieces that go into it. And um, Well, in, yeah. your, in your staff, how many, how many are involved in it? Um, gosh, well, we have five band directors, and uh, our percussion director, uh, Shane Bachelor, our associate band directors, Molly Bachelor, Casey Van Bibber, and Josh Ferris. Um, so the five of us, we work very closely together year-round, and that's kind of the core of our team. Um, we also have our two color guard coaches, uh, Chris McDonald and Ray Penfield. Well, I've seen you guys out in the community. I think I saw you at Panera one day having lunch oh, yeah. with, <laughs> that's with, our your, spot. with your group. <laughs> so uh, pretty amazing that you guys are so cohesive. And you bring together such a an amazing group of young yeah. <laughs> band Absolutely. performers. So, yeah, they work extremely hard. And we start. I mean, honestly, we're actually getting ready for preparations for next year. And that process starts pretty early on. And um, you know, so there's big news for next year, right? That's what we've been hearing in the community. What's the buzz? Yeah. So we're going to be taking the kids to a uh, kind of another step up from that super regional. It's called the Grand National Championships. And those are hosted. It's like the Super Bowl of bands. It's, wow. it's a little like that. Yeah, it, it's uh, you know, it's it's hosted in Indianapolis, Indiana, um, and uh, yeah, there'll be over a hundred bands there um, from all over the country, and it's a it'll be a great experience for our students. Wow, pretty amazing. Yeah. So the the stats that Dr. Plowman gave us is we are basically number two in our size of a school in the nation, probably. Uh, and that's always so tough to compare bands. I mean, everything in our activity is very subjective. Um, there are a ton of bands that are around our size that do just an absolutely incredible job. Even in here in Missouri, um, the number of bands here that are um, well, very similar to our size. He's sides. claiming that we're number two in Missouri <laughs> and that we're number one in Missouri in our class. Yeah, and so the way that BOA does their classes, uh, you know, they are... Uh, they, they, they use uh, school size, and it's actually grades 10 through 12 to kind of classify, you know, how... Nobody counts those freshmen ones. anyway. Yeah, right? <laughs> <laughs> They'll come around one day. <laughs> exactly. Uh, you know, so they have, um, you know, that's, that's kind of how we're sized. And we're in 2A, which is, you know, obviously, you know, the, the, the smaller half, I, I guess, of the, of the four groups. Wow. So, yeah. Well, congratulations, and thanks for your hard work. We know the kids have a lot to do with it, but... Uh, it's we just wanted to be more involved in the community and that's why we want to come and see the school well and not only that i want to thank you personally because um it takes leaders like you guys to teach these younger generations how to be future leaders and and that's what we try to do with our business and we're grateful that there's people like you that are doing that as well in the community well thank you so much i really appreciate it and just having an opportunity to be highlighted um the, the program 
um, it's it's a lot of hard work, like you said, in a in a big old village. Yep. So. <laughs> So that's it for Green Valley High School. I feel a little more educated. I do, and amazing facilities here in the Green Valley community. And I know there's other communities that have great facilities as well, but we're here in this community and we're involved and our kids go to school here as well. Our kids go here, our business is right over there across the freeway. This is where we hang out on Friday nights. Yep. So we wanted to, uh, to get a little more involved and this is how we're starting, so. Stick around, we've got more tours. So until next time, I'm Ben. I'm Ryan. We're the Pest Control Guys.